Hartstein. I'm here at the So You Think You Can Dance season nine finale. I'm so excited to be here and let's see who we can find. And I wanted to know your thoughts on tonight's finale. Uh, it was an amazing finale, great. Wow, it was kind of like, it just kind of hit me all at, like in one shot, like between the opening number and then the winners, it was like, I think my face went. <laughs> I saw that a couple times. You know, So You Think You Can Dance schedule is crazy. Yeah. What are you doing for the next three days? I'm going to sleep so much. I'm going to rest. I'm, I might just soak in a tub for three days. I know that sounds bad, but I might do it. <laughs> Okay, so also your choreo choreography, like together, it was like breathtaking. I was all like, whoa, okay? I was all like, please. So can you tell me about it and tell our audience at home who might have not watched the finale, which they probably did, but can you tell us all about it? Christopher, do you yeah. wanna go first? Yeah, um, yeah, it was really, uh, for me it was definitely a huge honor to get to collaborate with Sonia. Um, and it's something that we talked about kind of at the beginning of the season, really. It just kind of came about where like, let's do a collaboration. And we're like, okay. And it was like, <laughs> okay, this is gonna happen. And then uh, talking to the producers, it was like, finale. It okay. was it was crazy. I've been a big fan of this guy for many seasons. And I kept saying, I feel like, I don't know how, but I feel like it, we make sense in terms of dynamics and conviction of dancers. Right. What's next for you? Actually, I'm just getting done filming another movie right now. So uh, Tomorrow will be my last day. We wrap tomorrow, and uh, I think I might be signing on to do another movie in October. And then there's all this Fifty Shades of Grey talk, so who knows? We'll see. I, I think you should be in it. Just my personal opinion. I think you should be in every movie, but that's just me. So can you guys tell me a little bit about why you guys wanted to create Nappy Taps for LA and dancing? Yeah. Well, gosh, it started a while ago. How long have we had the business? Like over six, seven? Six, seven years. Yeah, six, seven years. We kind of started it because we were both uh, sponsored by Capizio and we were testing out products and things and we just felt like there was like a an area within the in the fashion that needed a little bit more of an urban flair versus your leotards and things like that. And there really wasn't anything out there that we felt was kind of hitting the mark. Like, I just met her and I'm always like, I'm already like, whoa, okay. Uh, yeah, what? Uh, okay, so can you tell me about tonight's finality and your thoughts? It was, it was the most fantastic Crazy. thing. It was anxiety. I've never had so much anxiety. It was such a good number. It was such so many good numbers from like, top to bottom like from top to bottom everyone was killing it it was their last time they were just going for blood everyone had so many matched energies together that it just created this epicness man it was amazing right it's one to remember definitely right okay i want to know how did you get your swag oh well you know i i don't, I don't think i can give away that kind of information but let's just say that you know swag is something that you have to develop you can't find it it doesn't find you you have to be made aware of it, you have to awaken it, and then you have to nourish it until it flourishes and develops. It's like being on So You Think and Dance almost. Yeah, it yeah. is actually. It, it, Tell me what are you wearing? This is from All Saints, and my shoes are Vera Wang. Oh, I like it, I like it. So All Saints, isn't yeah. that like, is, is that one of your favorite stores? Or? It is, it's a, one of my favorite stores just like for casual or kind of like a little bit like cocktail attire. What was your thoughts on the finale tonight? It was awesome. I definitely thought it was the best season ever and definitely one of the best finales. And starting off with that group number from Sonya and Christopher Scott, I mean, hello. I know. That was extraordinary. I have to tell you, I walked in this morning and I watched that number and I started crying and I had no idea why. There was no backstory or anything going on. I just kind of hit me and the dancing was so fabulous and I thought the whole concept of just of all of them struggling on stage against the win, representing what they went through this season, and that number was fabulous. It was fabulous. I had an amazing time. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you, Fox, for inviting me back a second time this season. I love you guys at Fox, and I love you guys at home. Can't wait to see you guys at home next week. All right, bye, guys. Hey, it's Ryan, and you're watching Total Relaxing.